Question. Explain the formation of the field lines due to the horseshoe magnet between its pole with an activity. Aim. To explain the formation of field lines due to the horseshoe magnet between its pole. Materials required. Wooden plank. Horseshoe magnet. Copper wire. Long wooden sticks. 3 volts battery. And a switch. Procedure. Take a wooden plank. Fix two long wooden sticks on it. These wooden sticks are split at their top ends. A copper wire is passed through these splits and the ends of the wire are connected to a battery of 3 volts through a switch. Close the switch and bring a horseshoe magnet near the current carrying copper wire. If there is no current in the wire, then there exists only magnetic field due to external source. When there is a current in the wire, it also produces a magnetic field. These two fields overlap and give non-uniform field. The field between the north and south pole horseshoe is as shown in figure. If a wire passes perpendicular to the paper and the current passes through it, it produces a magnetic field. The resultant field of these two is shown in the adjacent figure, as this is a non-uniform around the wire. We can see that the direction of the field lines due to the wire in the upper part of the circular lines coincides with the direction of the field lines horseshoe magnet. The direction of the field lines by wire in the lower part is opposite to the direction of the field lines of the horseshoe magnet so that the net field in the upper part is strong and the lower part is weak. Hence, a non-uniform field is created around the wire. Therefore the wire tries to move to the weaker field region.